Hey there runners, welcome back to our channel. Today's video is for all you fitness enthusiasts out there, as we dive into the top five best running shoes of 2024. Whether you're a seasoned marathoner or just hitting the pavement for the first time, we've got something for everyone. For more information of products, I have link included in description box. So lace up your shoes and let's get started. Number five, Asics, GT 2010. If you're passionate about running, this is the video for you. First things first, let's talk comfort and support. The GT 2010 features an engineered knit upper that not only provides a secure foothold, but also feels incredibly comfortable. It's like a second skin for your feet, ensuring a supportive fit that's perfect for those long runs. But it's not just about performance, it's about sustainability too. The sock liner of these shoes goes through a dyeing process that reduces water usage by approximately 33%. ASICS is not just enhancing your run, but also making strides towards a greener future. Now let's talk about the magic beneath your feet. The rear foot and forefoot GL technology cushioning system. It's like running on clouds. This technology attenuates shock during impact and toe off phases, allowing your foot to move seamlessly through the gait cycle. Say goodbye to discomfort and hello to a smoother run. Weight matters when you're running and ASICS understands that. The GT2010 incorporates Flytofoam technology, providing lightweight cushioning that doesn't compromise on support. It's the perfect balance for your every stride. And if you're craving that extra bounce in your step, look no further. The Flytofoam Propel technology, ASIC's energetic foam formulation, delivers supreme bounce thanks to a unique elastomer compound. It's like having springs in your shoes, propelling you forward with every stride. So, whether you're a seasoned runner or just starting your journey, the ASICS GT2010 is here to elevate your experience. Unleash your run, break your limits, and feel the difference with these incredible running shoes. Next on our list, the ASICS Nusa Tri 14 Running Shoes, the ultimate companion for your runs. If you're serious about your performance, you don't want to miss this. First up, let's talk about the Game Changer Fly to Foam Cushioning. Imagine running on clouds. These shoes provide lightweight impact absorption, giving you that extra bounce in your step without compromising on support. It's like your feet have their own personal shock absorbers. Now, let's get technical with Guide Soli technology. The curved sole design and stiff forefoot reduce ankle flexion, creating a shock absorbent landing zone. This not only lessens fatigue in your leg muscles, but also increases overall runner efficiency. It's science meets comfort and it's a game changer for your runs. Breathability is key, especially during those long runs. That's where the engineered mesh upper comes in. It's like giving your feet their own ventilation system. Say goodbye to sweaty and uncomfortable runs. These shoes keep you cool, dry, and ready to conquer any distance. Now, let's talk durability. The AHAR Plus outsole is strategically positioned in critical areas making it 50% more durable than your standard A6 high abrasion rubber. Whether you're pounding the pavement or hitting the trails, these shoes can handle it all. Say hello to longevity and goodbye to worn out soles. A6 doesn't just stop at performance, they're environmentally conscious too. The Solution Dye Sock Liner is produced using a process that reduces water usage and carbon emissions. So, not only are you investing in your running journey, but you're also making a positive impact on the planet. There you have it, folks. The A6 Nusa Tri. 14 running shoes. A perfect blend of technology, comfort, and sustainability. If you're serious about unlocking your full running potential, these shoes are a must-have. Check the links in the description to grab yours and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Third on our list. New Balance Fresh Foam X 1080 V12 Running Shoe. If you're a fan of pounding the pavement or conquering races, this one's for you. Let's dive right in. The New Balance 1080 has been a flagship neutral trainer, and with the latest V12 version, they've completely redesigned it from the ground up. Priced at $160, it's in direct competition with other heavy hitters like Brooks Glycerin, Hoka 11 Clifton, Saucony Triumph, and Endorphin. So, how does it measure up? Let's find out. Now, when it comes to cushion, the 1080 V12 faces stiff competition. Some might say it falls behind the likes of Brooks or Saucony. The toe-off might not be as snappy as others, but here's where it gets interesting. The upper steals the show. Made of a soft, engineered mesh, it cradles your foot like a dream. The lacing system and no-stitch overlay in the midfoot 
provide excellent structure, ensuring your foot stays locked in comfortably, and that cushioned tongue, a game changer for those long runs. Now let's talk about the ride. The redesigned sole unit features the fresh foam X material, but I have to admit, it felt firmer than its predecessor. With 36 millimeters of cushion under the heel, it's adequately cushioned, but does it live up to the hype? Well, it's a bit of a mixed bag. On my first run, I was expecting fireworks, but it was more of a spark. The shoe performed well, no doubt, but it lacked that wow factor. The bounce from the previous model was missing, and the toe roll didn't quite push me forward like I'd hoped. In conclusion, the New Balance Fresh Foam X1080 V12 is a solid performer. The upper is a standout feature, and the cushion is decent. However, the ride didn't quite wow me. At $160, it's a good investment, but I can't help but compare it to other options in the market, so would I recommend it? Absolutely, especially if you value a superior upper. But for the price, there might be better options out there. Number two, the Asics Gel Nimbus 25 running shoes. I recently got my hands on these and I've got a lot to share. So let's dive right in. Now, when I first saw the all white Nimbus 25 with no logos, I was intrigued. Clever marketing move, Asics. But the midsole had me confused. I initially thought it was the new Metaspeed Sky 2. Let's talk about the first time I tried them on. My first run was a 30 kilometers easy jog. And let me tell you, the ride felt firmer than the previous Nimbus, but the cushioning was on another level. Smooth transitions and a more substantial feel. That's what I experienced. Yes, there was some discomfort initially, but a little lace adjustment solved that problem. Going up that half size was the right call, providing the perfect fit and toe splay space. It reminded me of the Glide Ride 3, but landings were softer, and the padding in Nimbus 25 was top notch. Both are like long distance cruisers with bottomless cushioning. The engineered knit mesh upper is a game changer. Smooth, soft, and conforming to your feet. The new midsole defines the Nimbus 25 as a true max cushion trainer. The FF Blast Plus Eco might lack some bounce, but the added stack height compensates. The stiffer forefoot with rocker technology adds a unique twist. The silicone-based pure gel pad under the heel offers a touch of shock absorption. The redesigned outsole with A6 light rubber and AHAR on the heel is a winner. Durability is impressive, and the full ground contact ensures smooth transitions. Now, here's the kicker. With all the added features, the Nimbus 25 maintains almost the same weight as the 24 and comes at $160, a win for ASICS. In conclusion, the Nimbus 25 is ASICS's bold move, stepping out of the comfort zone. It might not be as agile, but for those slow, easy miles, it's a reliable companion. Last on our list, the Brooks Ghost Max. If you're a fan of the Ghost series or just looking for a versatile daily trainer, you're in for a treat. Stick around as we explore the features and my personal experience with this modernized version of Brooks' most popular running shoe. The Brooks Ghost Max is not just another running shoe, it's a spin-off from the highly acclaimed Ghost series. With a softer, more cushioned ride, it promises to take your runs to the next level. Now, let's break down what makes it stand out. First off, the Ghost Max boasts a higher stack height and weighs in at just 10 ounces, slightly lighter than its predecessor, the Ghost 15. But here's the kicker. The drop is only 6mm, half of what we're used to with the Ghost series. That's a game changer for sure. Now, let me share my first run experience with the Ghost Max. I took it out for an easy 10k, and wow, the ride felt noticeably softer and more nimble. It's like the shoe was eager to pick up the pace. However, I did notice a difference in fit compared to the regular Ghost. The arch was more pronounced when walking, but once I hit my stride, it vanished. Though I did have to switch to heel lock lacing for better foot lockdown. And can we talk about the Ghost Max upper? Brooks never disappoints there. True to size, perfect width, and no irritations. Let's talk performance. The Ghost Max is a crowd pleaser, appealing to Ghost loyalists and those who weren't quite sold on the regular Ghost. It strikes a perfect balance, soft enough for easy runs, yet firm enough for those up-tempo sprints. Comparing it to the Ghost 15, there's more foam in the heel and forefoot of the Ghost Max, making it an ideal choice for long-distance runners. In fact, I'd confidently say you can tackle a full marathon in these bad boys. Now, let's address the elephant in the room. The price. At $150, 
the Ghost Max is on the higher end for mid-range daily trainers. Personally, I believe it might be a tad expensive compared to its predecessor, the Ghost 15, which was priced at $140 last year. In conclusion, the Brooks Ghost Max is a stellar addition to the Ghost family, offering a plush ride and versatility for various running styles. If you can overlook the price, it's a top-notch choice for your daily runs. Thanks for joining me today. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and I'll catch you on the next run. Happy trails.